tournament has been sanctioned by the Emirates Cricket Board and it's approved by the ICC. It's a five franchise event. Uh, the first event will have 22 matches uh, played over uh, Sharjah, Abu Dhabi and Dubai. Each team has about 16 players, 13 foreign players and three Emirati players. Also have three associate players and a lot of development players included in every team. This T20 league is truly international. It's unique because it focuses on development of talent. Talent from full member countries, but primarily talent from associate members, which is our main focus. And the whole focus of what we're trying to do here is to bring players from all around the world to take part in this competition, to help develop young cricketers from associate countries and from uh, other countries where they may not have had an opportunity to play at the highest level in the past. This competition will introduce the sport to new uh, audiences in the UAE. It will develop the grassroots level and it will spread the game across the seven Emirates. We've structured this league to mean as for the top talent out there to be the best league that they want to go to. It's both financially competitive, they'll be in a very innovative player selection process that can really lead to a team making a, a core uh, nucleus for itself in terms of cricket as well as a brand. Uh, since the past and until today, uh, we've always hosted lots of international matches, whether it's one day international or T20. And we are strategically located, connecting the East to the West. Innovation is at the heart of this league, right? That's, that's how it differentiates itself from the rest of the leagues in the market. Uh, it'll be innovative in the way we are building up a team, innovative in the way we are engaging with our uh, fans, innovative in the way we are playing the cricket, the technology, the graphics that are brought into, into, the, into the league.